Martina Petanon, she is a fourth year student athlete with the Douglas College Women's Soccer Team. She joins the part of the Pac West Spotlight. Hi, Martina. Hi, thank you for having me. The season's done. Can you believe how fast it goes? Very fast. This honestly feels like like the fastest season out of all the years I've been playing here, but it, it feels like we just started yesterday. Yeah, yeah. Now, playoffs are still to come this coming yep. weekend, but just take me through the season because you didn't play last year. COVID canceled that. This year was kind of where we're going to play, where we're not going to play. Then you do play. What was it like? Um, This year, something definitely felt like a lot different this year, and like in a good way. I think it's because like we didn't play last year. So there was just a lot of like anticipation and I don't know, something about this year just felt more like intense and like, I don't know. And I, I love it though, but it just, now it like went by so fast. Now we have playoffs this weekend. So I don't know. It's just, I, this year's amazing. I love it. I'm just glad to be back on the field. Did it go faster than other seasons because there was such that anticipation to finally get back on the field and play and then all of a sudden it's done? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's exactly why, yeah. So tell me about the team. Seven wins this year, second place going into a semifinal. How do you feel this season unfolded? Um, I mean, the years that I've been here, I think that has been probably our best record, I think, um, or maybe tied with, but um, to it. yeah, <laughs> um, this year, no, it's been great. Like we didn't really know a hundred percent what to expect. We have like a very new team this year, um, tons of new rookies. And even from the year before we got many new players and um, we all just like connected so well. Uh, we had like a preseason trip. We went to Whistler and basically since, since that trip, things just like clicked and it has been amazing they all the new players bring like such great energy and I don't know something that I've realized like with this team is um just I guess how like resilient we are like we had a little downfall throughout the season but like right away we came back up mm. yeah so I don't know just the energy this year is like so much different and I love it was it fun to be a veteran player a fourth year student athlete yeah, it's definitely very weird. <laughs> I feel like I was just in my rookie year, but sure. something kind of, I guess, hit me this year, or maybe it was having that little break with COVID too, but I was like, oh, wow, like I'm one of the oldest players on this team. And um, it kind of made me realize like I need to take a leadership role and kind of be like that person that I needed in my first year. You know, my first year, there was a bunch of veterans on the team that I looked up to and um, who like kept us going, who were pushing us. So this year I'm like, oh my goodness, that's me. <laughs> so yeah, I'm trying my best. So. Did you like it though? Do you like taking the younger players kind of under your wing and say, okay, this is kind of how we do things? Honestly, yeah. yeah. I, I feel like it makes me like a better player, mm -hmm. um, especially on the field. I feel like I communicate a lot more than I did in past years. And I find that when I'm communicating, it just makes everything else like come way easier so yeah. I'm kind of I, I love it it's it's a big change but it's I think for the best yeah people are looking at you and listening to the, the play. oh okay Martina says that okay let's go do that yeah listening to me oh my goodness <laughs> <laughs> well let's look at your matchup you have the VIU Mariners in the semifinal on Saturday boy you've played this team already three times awfully tough to play a team four times isn't it in one I know. season yeah um well, I think it was two years ago, we were playing each team four times. So one less this year, but it's still, it's still a lot. So um, yeah, we're definitely just focused on that game. Um, we're all super excited. I can't stop thinking about it. <laughs> it's hard to focus on other things, but um, yeah, I mean, I think our team's ready. We have, I know we have like the skill, we have, we have it all to um, win that game for sure. It's just from now on, I think it's just a mental thing and yeah. Uh, it comes down to kind of leadership on that day um, and just you. working as a team. Yeah. It's you. You're the leader now. You're the oh, fourth no. <laughs> <laughs> Can okay, you say you can't stop thinking about it? So what, what goes through your mind? Are you thinking strategies? Are you thinking plays? Are you thinking opponents, like specific opponents that you want to try to take advantage of? Um, I mean, for me, I think it's just that my, my eyes are on the championship. Um, in my first year, we, we won the Pac West championship and I just always think about like that feeling and how amazing it was. And so, I don't know, I just, 
I mean, this is how it is for me every week. I'm constantly thinking about soccer. I, I'm watching game tape all the time. And I mean, this week it's even more. I'm just, I'm just super excited to get out there. Um, I mean, honestly, yeah, just championships. That's all I could think about. That's all I want. <laughs> is I it wanna... important or crucial maybe to score first in a game like this? I, I would imagine the game will be tight. You're very well matched between the Royals and the Mariners. Is scoring first kind of the thing you have to do? I think that's a big thing. It's, it definitely sets the tone for the game. Um, and, you know, I, we ha like our team has been in a position where another team scores first and we come back. I, I don't doubt that we can come back. This, right. That's the thing about our team that is really good this year is like, we don't let that hurt us. Like that kind of motivates us in a way, but in this position this weekend, like especially having that first goal is a big thing. And especially like, you know, first 15 minutes, I think, you know, you got to push, you got to go. That's, we want to get that goal right away. So, yeah. But still, soak it all in. So yes. all of this is I know. Yeah. 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 Well, listen, thanks for doing this. Good luck on Saturday. And we'll be talking to you down the road. Awesome. Thank you so much.